Recently, there's been a call for all the uh, fellow vegans or people who eat a whole food plant-based diet to donate their stool for what we call FMT or fecal microbial transplant. This is a procedure where you take somebody's stool who has a healthy gut bacteria and you transplant it into somebody who has illness or inflammation in the colon. So uh, why is it that vegans or people who eat a whole food plant-based diet are good donors? You know, there's been a number of studies on the microbiome and diet in, in mice and men, let's say. And it's really clearly shown in mice is that if you want to induce obesity and disease, just put someone on a Western diet. And then you can take those microbes from the mice that are sick and fat and put it into just normal mice and make them sick and fat. Right. So we know that the gut microbiome can really itself become transmit this process that really is diet sensitive. We also know that the plant-based diet is the best way to really expand the microbiome in a healthy manner. And then if you take that in 24 hours, you can take someone down the street to McDonald's and they have a, you know, a purge with the Western diet. They get quite sick in 24 hours and you can change the microbiome in a very unhealthy way like they did in Supersize Me. And then you can reverse that with a plant-based diet as well. The, the, the yin and yang couldn't be more clear. Yes, yeah. so the, the gold standard is now for the stool to come from a person who's eating a whole food plant-based diet. Yes. So all of you vegans, please uh, go ahead and look into this and um, help people who need the microbiome. And can you ask for a skinny donor too? Because I mean, you could lose weight too, huh? That we know they've done, they've, there's been some cases where people have donated when they're overweight and they've made the donor big when they were otherwise lean. That's but there are probably studies looking to do vice versa is give the donation from a lean donor to uh, someone who's not. But uh, those experiments probably take a lot of challenges getting through clearance with the FDA and so on and so forth. But they're experimental. But I there is it. mice data to show that that does work. <laughs> Let's do this. Mice. Thank you so All right. much. All right.